Welcome back everybody to Mario Everybody's Golf on PlayStation 4. Gonna play Balata today. Regular T's normal cups, all 18. We've not set a score for this. And I've got the big clubs out, so I'm expecting to um, score heavily and score often. So, first one. Downhill, upwind. Let's see what we can do with it. I always find these sort of downhill driver shots really hard to judge the distance on. Yeah, they seem to just race through. That's alright in the rough, but it's not awful. I get a chip back. Probably no worse than a than a putt anyway. Okay. It's a little bit of wind and a little bit of run on it, but nothing terrible. If I can get it close. Oh, could have done with that drop him. But we'll take the birdie. They need to get that set, that tee shot closer. But controlling onwards. Yeah. So we're one under. Hole two is actually straight. It's just that tree gets in the way. I've got the super side and top spin. Should get a nice landing spot. Yeah. And it's a little bit up at the finish, which just sort of kills it. Okay. However, time for another chip. They don't get much straighter than this. And we land it. Ooh. No, got to hit the impact really at that distance. To have any chance of the eagle. But we get another birdie pot. It's a two under after two. Not the best start ever, but you know, it's okay. It's a three, it's a par five. Again, no, no finesse required. Hit the thing as hard as you can. Got the ultra spin this time. And get down to that little hollow, maybe. All right, nearly 400 yards. So 78 to go. Yes. Well, I certainly got it high. Massively overhit. So we're getting an eagle putt this time. Sloping down, I think. Just gotta let it roll. There we go. Okay. Got the eagle. Well, that's a bit better. I've only ever parred the next one. Is a par three. Let's have a look at this one. Not really got a lot of room to work at the front. Sort of gathers in a bit, doesn't it? Alright, let's have a little pop of this. A little bit downhill, a little bit downwind. Missed the impact. I suspect that's not horrible though. That's okay. So, just a bit over 10 foot. I'm going to hit it gentle. Hope it breaks. There she goes. Five under. And improve my um, hole record, which is always a good thing. So it's another one that's slightly round the corner, but drivable. Ah, missed the spin. I think that's going to end up in the woods. Oh, got a good bounce, got a good bounce. Back on the fairway. Almost on the green. So, chip time again. See if I can land one of these. Ah, missed the impact. Good, good. Needs a bit of luck. Didn't get it. A bit of a tough putt back. 
Trust if you miss it. Oh, back door save, mate. Six under. Yeah, that's eagleable for sure. If I could land those chips, I'd be nine under. But I didn't, and I'm not. All right. So this one's a little bit downwind. And a little bit uphill. Missed it. Just got standard spin on it. Oh, trees. Oh, I thought I was going to hit that tree. Is that going to come out? Look at that on the green. Not the conventional route. So we have what can loosely be described as a massive part. So maybe there. So what is it going to play? It's going to play about 65 feet. That's about 75 feet. However, comma, you lose a bit from the bend. Oh. You really can't leave yourself those putts, though, if you're going to have a chance. So, seven under. Another par three that I've only managed to par in the past. It's that little tucked in T, isn't it? Pin there. And that little slope will kill it. Ah, missed the impact. Yeah, just a bit, a bit left. Got another chip. Surely one of these chips is going to drop eventually. Just the law of averages. There you go, like that. Shame it's the birdie one that drops and not the eagle one though. However, putting together a reasonable score. Oh, hey, it's a par four. So again, this is pretty straight and drivable. Master Hall. Looks good. Good, good. I have fluked a hole in one on this one before. I was much further left and just sort of flicked it in. Came up through the rough. However, that's not a bad effort for 15. Mm. Super hard to judge this one as well. Gonna be low. Ah. What can you do? Get the birdies, what you can do. There we go. So it gets us to nine under. Par five to finish this off. It's a par five. So this is the question mark hole. No real shortcut available. Just got to play it up here as well as you can. And leave yourself a second shot. Oh, I've gone a bit right, haven't I, with the wind? I'm going to be in the rough. That's a mistake. Don't take your eye off the gauge. Okay, so 187 to go. Bit of wind. I'm in the rough. It means I've got very little control over the thing. Didn't get the impact. That's short. But I've got a putt though. Don't let the eagle slip. So we've got an eagle putt. Show me what you got. I won't blink. Not exactly sure which way this one's gonna go. It's kind of going against itself. Got it, got it, not the eagle. So that's not bad, eleven under, but we missed some chances. We missed some chances. That's not a bad, it's not a bad nine holes. Again, with the custom clubs on this course, it, it's just about getting near the pin. I'm trying to chip some in. So let's start the in with nine. Mm. Oh, I always like this one. There's a bit of fun to be had with this one. Ah, missed it. Trying to get more spin on it. Oh, Is he going to land on that down slope? Is he going to get a bounce? Ah, needs to be a bit further on. It's just on that bit of fairway, isn't it? 
Still, we get a chip. Pin's moderately interesting. This needs a bit of mustard on it just because of that slope. Get in there. Oh, if that had hit the pin, it would have dropped. See, the problem with that one is you've got to give it the mustard because of the slope, which of course means when you actually get it on there, it's going super quick. Got the birdie, though. So, par four next. This is threading the needle, as we like to call it. Because of the wind. Right, went further left than I thought it would. Oh! I wasn't actually playing for the pin, I was playing for the middle of the green, but that was close. Never mind. Can we get it on the way back? No, oh, not quite. So we get the birdie. But the albatross was there. 13. That doesn't tell the story, does it? This is a rank two tournament, so they're on um, ridiculously bad scores. Which shows you what the game thinks of Balata, doesn't it? Uh, it's probably about there. Again, you kind of got to drop it short. So it's downhill. We got that up there near? Uh, that's okay. Just off. Could have done with being a bit better. What does your boy want? chip in with a rising shot doesn't want much does he for his three gems I've over here it's gonna have to hit the pin there you go I'll take my three gems for those who don't know that super or ultra top spin causes the rising shot when you hit the pin on a chip Worth it for the three gems, especially that close. You can't really miss, and I'd probably play it with topspin anyway. It's a par five. It's thirteen again. Par five that's straighter than it looks. Masterful. That's okay. Tricky one to judge again. Needs a bit of pace. It's going to kind of flop down. But at the same time, it means it'll be faster at the lands. Ho oh, ho ho! Of course, hitting the pin is the other way to do it. Is that for the albatross as well? Get in there. I think that's an official albatross. Yeah, my 21st albatross. Well, there you go. Well, you go. First time I've albatrossed that one. That was a beauty. It's a 14. I think you can drive this. Yeah, you can. The real question is if you can... Yeah, you can get it over those trees. I'm going to land in the rough, but that's okay. I'm going to run. Yo ho ho ho. That's about as close to the water's edge as you want to be. So, time for another chip. Again, needs a bit of pace because it's in the rough. Go on. Oh. Is that three in a row? Oh. Nice. Didn't get the rising shot, though. Nice. Gonna miss the impact. Gets us to 19. It is three chippings in a row. I'll take that. So 15, again drivable. I might even try the three wood here. Just to give myself a little bit of wiggle room. I mean, I can hit it as hard as I like as well. I'm going to 
little roll around the corner. Oh, I just checked, didn't it? Again, close though. Gives us another chip. Again, same rules. The altitude means you've got to kind of flop it up there. But it'll be a bit pacey when it gets there. Again, in the hole. We found our chipping range, didn't we? So that's 21 under. Four chips in a row. For 800 in those four holes. Now again, you can reach this one. Obviously, it's a par three. It's all about the position of that pin. It's bang tight in the front. So we're going to go backspin. Missed it. It's the problem with playing the backspin. You get a bit of um. Well, it's okay. You get a bit of variation on it. So again, we're going for five in a row. Can we get it? Got the impact. Got it. Five in a row. Yeah, I've given up putting. So that's 22 under. Yeah, I've given up putting. Right, 17. It is a par four, Mr. Suzuki. It's uphill though, which means it's a difficult one to reach. Uh, I didn't put any spin on it. I was trying to get the ultra spin on it, so I got a little bit of right hand on it, but that's okay. It should get up on the green. Just. Oh, not quite. Didn't quite make it. Never mind. Again, six in a row on the cards. This is a more difficult one. A lot more height to deal with and a quite a bit of slope. Nah, we missed it. I'm going to have to actually take a part. Not used to this club. What does this club do? Alright, does that. So that's 23. Par 5 to finish. Yeah, you've got to hold up for the water, haven't you? Our boy wants 320 and change, doesn't he? Question is whether I've put it out the front. Oh, I think I have, haven't I? That's too much mustard. Is it? No, it's okay. It's going to hold. That's good. I'm going to take my two gems. A little stab in at this one. Not the super side spin. Oh, that's not far away. Can we get the eagle to finish? For 25? Yeah, we can. Yeah, we can. It's 25 under. That first nine, though, there was three shots left behind. So I could have got 28 there. Although, you know, you can't really count on that albatross on 13 every time. One by 22 strokes. That's a rank two tournament for you. But nice playing the tournaments because you get the chance to do the missions as well. Which you don't get the standard single player. Uh, we missed a couple of greens. We missed a fairway or two. So not perfect. There's more to come there, isn't there? Okay, I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please like, share and subscribe. And I got my level 15 back. Thank you. Uh, see you next time for a little bit. Oh, got some stuff as well. Um, gems. Give me gems. Give me gems. Oh, side spinner ball. No, never mind. I'll see you next time for a bit more everybody's golf. Okay.